Hi guys. <clears throat> Excuse me. Well, I can't get this camera to work now, no matter what batteries I put in. So, I thought I'd take it apart. Um, it's a Practica Slim Pix 5250. It used to work, but for some reason it's not working now. <clears throat> so, I thought I'd just take it apart. There's probably not a lot to it, but... Never know. Right, one screw here under the battery pack. Under the battery cover, I should say. Another one there under the battery cover. Get out of there. <coughs> and we've got one here. What I could see, there was only two more. There's one on this end. And another one. This end, there isn't any in the top. <coughs> well, knowing my look, it's probably just removes the trim, does it? Must remove something. Anything? <coughs> I just want a small flat tip to act as a lever. Come on. Something's got to come off. <laughs> ah. Ah, it does take the cover off. Just, uh, maybe if I'm careful enough, I could put it back together. There's the screen cable. I'm in. <coughs> Put my uh, <coughs> Phillips head back in. Might get away with that one. I will separate these two pieces, I think. Or at least take the circuit board out. But, uh, that's the main circuit board on your screen, and it looks like they've even got a speaker here. It's the only thing with wires going to, and it, does, it looks like a little um, piezo speaker. Is that on camera? Bring it in a bit, see? Um, does the screen ca oh, the screen cable plugs in. Okay. Pop that open, pop that off, and hopefully, if I'm gentle, nope, just pulled the wires off the bloody piezo buzzer. Oh, oh well. Well, now the tape decides to fall off. Well, that was glued in anyway. Oh, there we go, got it off. Right. How is the screen fitted? It's got two rubber pads here. One in this corner and one in this corner. Um, my, uh, yeah, now you can see the pads. That part to one side for the moment. So far I can see three screws that hold the circuit board in place. So that's 
ruined it. Okay. more. Yep, one up in the corner. One piece. Yay! Right. It's quite simple. Um, camera really, there's nothing to it. I've got the dinky little uh, flash unit here. Where's my dinky little um, flash there? The flash capacitor there. And the camera itself. Memory card holder, battery holder, two AAA batteries. Uh, we've got the micro USB on the end there. Is that actually is it soldered? Yeah, it is that angled board here is actually um, soldered like that. microphone flapping around here which uh I'm have that <laughs> this is actually quite easy to determine what chip does what on the back here you've got this top one I know for a fact. So how to fix your flat? How to fix a flicking fl <laughs> flashlight? This top one here, where my thumb is, that's a Nanya, which is, if I remember correctly, that is probably the onboard memory chip. And I'm guessing the Zorum, Zorum, will be the um, processor chip. Well, there's another chip underneath the memory card slot. I can't see it. It does look possibly like another memory chip. Because I know these cameras, despite the ability to um, put in a memory card, they do have some small on onboard storage. Which will be what that chip is for there, most likely. Of my thumb, and uh, I'm no expert, but I'd say that was probably the processor chip. Uh, if you want to search it, it's ZR36441 BGCF, and it's Zoran, Z O R A N. There is something else written on there, but I can't quite see it. Yeah, like I said, there is a chip hiding underneath this memory card slot, but as I break that off, I'm not going to see what it is. Is there any way I can pop it off? Yep. 
Well, I'll pop the shield off anyway. That has revealed a bit more. Let's see it now, right beside the camera, right here where my thumb is. Um, can't quite read what it's got written on there. So if I just pop the plastic cradle off for the memory card. Or just break some of the plastic out of the way. Right, what is it? Hynix, I think that says. That does actually remind me of uh, yeah, another possibly memory chip of some sort hiding in there. And that is it. That's that is bugger all to these cameras. It's no wonder they're pretty cheap to get. And why the picture quality is so piss poor. I bet the one I'm currently using is um, probably not much better, or much different, I should say. Um, apart from having a better quality camera on it than this one. going to work now because I've just broken a header. Oopsie. Oopsie. Might as well take that board off then. Oh, that was only screwed in, was it? Oh, no, it soldered. It is actually a little header. Ah, well, that's pretty cool. It is actually a little header that just plugs in like that. Let me um, unplug it. Where's my light? See it right on that corner there, that little black block? That is actually a header that you can plug things into. Right there. And that's all this board, which houses all the flash and the um, on-off button and the um, take-a-picture button. Houses all of that. Another little screw in there that holds the flash down. Hmm. What if I can stick power to this and uh, get it to flash? What's the pack capacitor on this? 330 volts. Oh, it's actually labelled as photo flash. 80 um, microfarad. That's just 330 WV. I've never seen that before. Anyone knows? Let me know. Well, I've never seen it. What is it? It's a HEC brand. Uh, TRW05. That might be a useful little cap there, at least to drive a little flash. Ooh. Let's take the um, cover off the camera, shall we, if we can. If the... Nope. Got to change the crosshead bit. I need a different one. <sighs> Ouch, that's sharp. Let's try this one. Bugger, can't get a, can't find a screwdriver that'll fit, lads. Ha! Okay. Da da Okay, note to self, hold the screws <laughs> as they are um Spring loaded. Mm. Ah, take two 
two screws out at the back here. Camera's actually a chip on the board. <clears throat> right, dead center. Oof, getting dazzled off the lens, that's actually quite reflective. Oops. Bye bye, lens. <clears throat> I'm not picking that up now. like a little LED, but I doubt it is somehow. That's right. <clears throat> Get this out of the light. Right there. I wonder if that's the, um, <clears throat> some sort of light sensor to activate and deactivate the flash. Because that is pointing to the front of the camera. That would be... Yep, just below the flash that would be, so that would be there. Poking through that dinky little hole. <coughs> Dear me. Interesting. Very interesting. Multitasking. Oh, we don't want that bin anymore, do we? Seriously? That's just gone straight in the bin. <coughs> that was a good shot. And I can't see nothing else, well, that interests me. Buttons. That's about it. But we all know what buttons do. They activate things and change things and... Found a little clock crystal for the onboard clock. <coughs> Yep, it's all surface mount, which I pretty much expected. Anyone want a camera? I suppose you could put it back together and run your own battery pack to those term <coughs> terminals and hide it in something. I don't know what you'd hide it in, but you could hide it in something. Anyway, that's it for this video. Thank you very much for watching. If you liked the video, then don't forget to hit the like button. And don't forget to subscribe for more videos. So, uh, I'll talk to you again in the next one. Bye!